My name is Felix Krückels. I'm the product manager of the MC Square series with Lavo. The company Lavo was founded 37 years ago. It's placed in Germany, in Rastatt, in the southwest of uh, Germany. We started doing analog consoles already 30 years ago, analog modi consoles. We did the first digital control desk in the mid of 80s, digital control and analog uh, processing. The first fully digital desk was done with the MC80 in the mid of the 90s. And then we launched three years ago at NAB, the MC Square 66, and uh, one year ago at the AES in Vienna, the large format console, the MC Square 90. Yes, on the convention AES in Vienna this year, we show the first time uh, a full plug-in integration into the MC Square series, MC Square 66 and MC Square 90. Plugin integration means that you have full control of all VSD plugins, that you have the possibility to store all the plugin parameters within the normal uh, mixing console snapshot and you can recall all the parameters even with your dynamic automation. That means now we have all the colors plugins bring with them in a live uh, broadcast live uh, PA desk as well, like you know it from DAWs. So that means we aimed to merge the two worlds, plug-in DAW uh, colors and a full mixing console together into one system. The big benefit, of course, is you have all the reverbs, all the EQs, you know from Sony Oxford, for example, you know from Waves, you know from UA or you know from TC, are able to install. The installation routine is quite easy. It works the same like you do this on a normal Windows computer. This computer then knows all the plugins which are installed. The control system uh, in the desk grabs these plugins as known plugins. One plugin can be assigned to an effect slot and then automatically all the parameters are learned by the control system. This is the reason why we can store and recall all the parameters. Once a plugin is installed to an effect slot, audio tie lines between the server and the HD core, which is our main routing system, are set up automatically. That means even the setup of the plugins to effect slots are stored within the production. It's our top hierarchy uh, of storing and recalling uh, the settings for the mixing console. For example, you make a production today and you want to use some reverb, some special vocoders, whatever you want to use out of the plugin world are assigned to different plugin slots, to different effect slots. You have to remix the whole uh, production in one year. You just load the production and everything comes back. All the settings, even in a dynamic automation, you can uh, have special moves in your EQ, reverb or whatever. We showed this the first time on the MC Square 66 this year. Of course, you can have this in all the MC Square series desks of the third generation MC Square 66 and MC Square 90.